And good morning. Welcome to the Gospel of Luke. We're in Luke 16, today verses 5 through 7. The unjust steward's been accused, and uh, because he is a, a morally bent person, he's all wrong, now he's got to do something. Here's his plan. Let's see what it is. So he called every one of his master's debtors to him and said to the first, How much do you owe my master? And he said, A hundred measures of oil. So he said to him, Take your bill and sit down quickly and write fifty. Then he said to another, How much do you owe? So he said, A hundred measures of wheat. And he said to him, Take your bill and write eighty. So here's the plan. He's going to falsify the facts so that, yeah, he's not going to come up with, with uh, the, the amount that he should come up with. Instead, they're going to change the amount that is owed, and then he'll be able to deliver it back. So that's going to look like everything's in order. So it's going to look like everything's in order when it's all done. You know, everything's going to be accounted for. Why? Because he's messing with the books. This is, this is false bookkeeping. This is fraud. And I don't know what all the legal definitions are, but uh, this, is, this is purely, very definitely fraudulent. And now he's going to uh, not only be uh, wrong, but he's inviting these other people to join him in the crime and they all look like they're going to, you know, hey, we're going to make a score here. We're going to come out better financially. So it sounds like a lot of these guys are going to go along with it. Don't ever join in when somebody puts a crime like this together. Don't become part of it. You, you stay faithful. No, no, no. I owe 100. I will pay 100. God will reward you for that. But don't say, okay, he says I can do 50. We, we and I, he and I both know I'm a, I'm a, this is a, a, a lie. But hey, I'm going to make 50 on this. So I'm going to do it. Don't ever do that. Never. Don't ever do that. Be faithful to God, and he will be faithful to you. So this is the plan. This is the plan. He's going to try to, de he's going to do further defraud his master. How's that going to be? Well, join me tomorrow morning, and we'll see the master's response and the lesson. In the meantime, let's pray. Dear Father in heaven, we see that wickedness is it causes additional wickedness. You have to add wickedness to cover up something that's not done right. Help us, Lord, never to participate in something like that, whether it has to do with this or that or any number of things. Lord, help us to be right with you, always right with you, and it'll always work out in the end. Thank you for hearing our prayers. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Always do what's right. Always do what's right, and you will be blessed.